It's in the square now. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. um, we're just doing a compassionate listening video. I have three minutes. And what I wanted to talk about this, this morning, this is Tuesday morning, and what I wanted to talk about was we just talked with a nutritionist that um, Maria Zilka that works at um, the office that Dr. Nye works at and we talked to him about our diet and um, what would address you know the best way that our diet could address the cancer and she said that she felt that we were doing all the right things um, the main thing that she wanted to change about our diet was not quite so much um, vegetables into vegetable juice to, to make a smaller amount and also to try to get more nuts and oils into Diana, like coconut oil and such, which are things we eat already, but to try to use them because Diana's down to 103 pounds and we're trying to get back up to 110. So just to use more oils and nuts and, um, and then a different way to cook rice that would make it more um, nutritious and less likely to feed the cancer from the starches. So um, it felt like a good meeting with her and I felt like we got some good information out of it and she's going to look on YouTube and look at some of our um, videos so she can informally meet Diana on, on YouTube. And that's, and then Diana got a, just got a um, hyperbaric chamber in just now. So um, I feel very good about this morning except that she's really low on energy right now. Um, but other than that, it feels good and that's, that's the end of my time right now. And oh, you want to get that phone? There's the telephone. Okay. From Palm Day. Hi, this is Doug. Hello. Um, you can speak with me. I'm her husband and caregiver. I am. Is she ill? Um, it depends. <laughs> So, what can I do for you? Right. Right. S sir? Sir? Can I just tell you that this is a, a very inappropriate time right now? And could you please take us off your list? Okay. Um, Thank you. Bye-bye. Okay, here you go. I'm going to put the timer down. Okay. Okay. Um, so, uh, this is compassionate listening. So, I have three minutes to go into my heart and tell you what's going on. First, I'm going to um, tell you that something wonderful happened yesterday. Um, I called my mother and told her about compassionate listening. So she went first and she shared for three minutes and then I did. And um, I, I felt so close to her. It was like we had been on the phone um, for 20 minutes. And she told me that she hired someone to help her husband, Ralph. Um, he's very old. And this is going to give her a week to catch up with herself. Um, and, um, you know, when other people take care of themselves, it's so much easier to take care of yourself, like me, like I need to take care of myself. Um, so when Doug was talking with the, um, nutritionalist today, I was so excited because, um, I, um, I'm too thin. And I have to eat mega, macadamia nuts. I mean, what could be better than that? I'm so happy. <laughs> oh, my goodness. I mean, you could put them all around the house and hide them just like their dog treats. treats and I'm going to find every one of them. <laughs> um, the other thing that was really wonderful today was... The nutritionist, her father, had pancreatic cancer. He went to the hospital, then he went home, and he lived for eight years. He didn't do any treatments. He didn't 
use he didn't do enemas he didn't do uh, special herbs and he I mean my god eight years with no treatment that I'm feeling very hopeful very hopeless hopeful um, since I have a little more time I'm gonna realize that I can speak slowly I don't have to hurry I want to tell you about the backyard. We um, are not, we're getting rid of the grass and we, we have a big, we have a circle um, of grass and then the rest is going to be mulch and um, um, decomposing dirt. Um, and I've been, today, Today, I took one of those little bags that you're supposed to put poop in, but instead, I, um, I went to a neighbor's yard and just scooped up a little of this, um, it's a purple flower that propagates everywhere. I, I planted some and, um, around the circle, and so that big space, within probably a year, it will be covered with purple flowers and that is much nicer than grass. My time is up and um, thank you for being parting of, part of our healing story. Thank you. That's it.